Hi everyone, I'm Thalma and my channel is Seasonal Crafts and Creations. I do a lot of Dollar Tree hauls and DIYs and I do every now and then some vlogs and learn how to apply makeup with me. And I also go every now and then to some other stores like Hobby Lobby and Five Below and stores like that. Um, today I have for you three different a haul from three different stores the Dollar Tree Family Dollar and Amazon so without further ado let's go ahead and get started okay first I'm showing you this because I have one it's the navy blue I'm wearing it this came from the Dollar Tree it's called uh, Junter Women's Kit um, headband let me show you that so you can see it and I do believe these were the the black and the navy was the last two colors they had when I was there but the manager said they had like pink and red and some a couple other colors and this is a brand that I've been seeing a lot at the Dollar Tree so there's a possibility of when they run out they'll get more of them in and they stretch that's what it looks like about the size of my head as you can see but it stretches real big and you can't beat that for a dollar twenty-five and then there's this um, real pretty beanie uh, beanie hat I just call them hats it has a cross on the top or a plus sign and Turns out to be that that long, or you can you can fold it all the way up to the black, which is real soft. And let me see the back. I'll go ahead and put it on to show you. It fits real good, and it keeps you nice and warm too. And and this headband, you can wear it out without. A beanie or anything and it, it keeps your ears and everything real nice and warm but that's what this looks like and they had these in all different colors too I'm trying to hold the there we go but that's what that looked like okay and The other night, I um, I was in the kitchen doing some dishes, and even with the light above the stove, and because uh, the way our kitchen's made, the light's way off on one side in the ceiling, but there's an extra spot where the where the counter and the the sink is, and the cabinets. So I went ahead because this on the back of this light switch on each side, about right here. You peel it off, and, and there's those sticky things. You push it onto the wall, and it already has batteries with it. I'm going to hold it like this so I don't blind you. But that right there shows you how much light you see reflecting off my hand, and you can see how the shadows are. But And I'm going to put this one. I put that one on the left side. Uh, where the window is and this one's going on the right side that way um, it re see it takes three triple-a batteries but that way there'll be extra light and you can see without straining your eyes and uh, they get these in all the time okay next I want to show you this it's from Floral and Garden Nose Nose <laughs> Gnomes Ribbon It's a 5 5 eighth inch by 108 inch Or 9 foot And look at them cute little gnomes They're just so stinking cute I love gnomes anyway I like them And then I picked up some Broadway Color Black Super Strong Hode uh, Eyelash Adhesive 
It's for putting on fake nails. And then here's some uh, Sassy and Chick uh, fashion nails. And they're like a pinkish color that goes above your nails. And then there's pink and go glitter here. And there's 12 nails. And I picked up, it's Lumen Essence, Apple Cinnamon, Tea Light Candles. You get eight of them. And this has a real uh, strong scent to it. You can really smell the cinnamon with a hint of apple. It really does smell good. And now I knew they've had the matte yellow Mod, Mod Podge, but I didn't know they had the gloss, which is the orange label. If you can see, see the difference there. And this is a two full ounce, not a bad deal for a dollar twenty-five. And <coughs> excuse me. And this is Craft Wise chalkboard paint in black. And I have a white here, but I can't find it. But it comes in black and white that I know of there. And then I found in Crafter Square some more of that glitter. We have gold, silver, and red. And these are real good colors to use. Um, for Valentine's Day. My mind went blank there. I was getting ready to say Easter. <laughs> and, um, but those would be real nice. And I've seen some paint brushes. This one is five piece art brushes. There's uh, five different sizes with a long handle, and it comes from Crafter Square. And this is a two-piece. You get a, a real wide one with a thick handle. And then you get one that's long but skinny. And then I picked up this five-pack of sponge brush sets. And they're all different sizes. There's a real big one. And the smallest one are these real small ones right here. Okay, now I am showing you some Valentine Day stuff. Normally, I don't like this uh, tinsel stuff, but this here with the shiny on the love, well, look how pretty the O and the E is in that, like a mauve looking pink. Real beautiful, and they're big too. I mean, they're at least two and a half foot long. And probably eight um, inches tall. And then there's the XOXO. I love that. These would look good um, in a reef or up on the wall by himself, above a door, um, on a garland where you do a loop and put it in the center and get a make a bow and put on it that would look real nice now I picked up three of these and two of them are tangled so I'm trying to get the one out that's not tangled up okay this is 12 foot long tinsel garland and it's red real shiny Here's the end to show you how thick it is. And look how cute these little hearts are. Real beautiful. Now, if these hearts fall off, all you have to do is cut the little end that sticks out that had, had it attached to the garland. And don't use a um, hot glue gun on it because it'll just melt. But put some Mod Podge on it and this will look cute with any of your DIY Valentine projects.
Okay, and I have some of these little wooden, I see, it just says decor, but it's like a pitcher. The sides are about an inch, and inside it's probably about a half an inch from here to the back. And it says, love you always with hearts. But this heart here is glued in there. And then there's the XOXO, or I should say X heart. The heart is real pretty, baby pink. And the background here is pink. The X's are a little darker with a little bit of white trim. Those are, this is beautiful. And then this one says hearts and hugs with two hearts glued in there. Now these you can hang them up or you can lean it, set it up or lean it up against uh, like the wall or something. You can take it apart, make something out of it, you know, different DIY. Uh, but I love them just the way they are. And the last one, it says date night and there's hearts and this heart is glued in there okay that's it from nope I'm sorry I have two more things I finally found some of the real good baby breath from the Dollar Tree um, it came in this is I bought three but this is how thick they are and it's the regular stem now you can see put some roses in that and that'll look just beautiful now uh, just a little tip when you go to get these in the bag have them put it in this way that way they won't be hanging out in the bag rubbing up against the little white the baby's breath and getting it all over the place and then it'll be uh, making your uh, stems kind of bare and naked and you don't want that okay and I picked up two more of these long stemmed velvet roses they still haven't gotten in their regular uh, roses with with like four to five of them on it but look look at how beautiful that is just in case you haven't seen one of my videos my hauls with these in I'll show you. Get one more and put it right here. And then spread them out. Put it in a vase. You can either bend this or you can cut it. And um, they're just beautiful. They're romantic. Um, real beautiful. Okay, that's, let's see. It's on the... Dollar Tree now. I'm going to get into the family dollar. Okay, first I want to show you. They have these at the Dollar Tree, but they're out of them. Um, these are the LED lights. And this one's like rocks. And this one is the big red hearts. See how big that is? And they... Normally get them in pink, too. Real light pink hearts, but they were out of them. Okay, and I found another one of these. Um, it's just a, a DIY Valentine's sign, and it's a dollar. And you get four hearts on it, and they twirl around and round. You can take them off and use them on something else. Uh, paint them on both sides. I like how it has the heart inside of it right here. And I have one of these I got from the Dollar Tree and another one that said, I think I love you more. But I was thinking um, in the kitchen where, I, where it dips down as you go over to where the stove and stuff is, put some garland up there and paint these and then have this one hanging on one side and the other one just like this one on the other and the other one, I love you more, in the center with some flowers and stuff up there. I think that'll look real romantic. 
Let me know how you plan on decorating um, for Valentine's Day. What's your uh, color and theme going to be? Okay, and I found two more of these wooden hearts. And they were only um, a dollar. I should have picked up one more, but I wasn't thinking. Okay. And I found another pack of these at Family Dollar. I picked up two of them at the Dollar Tree, but could never find them again to get them. And I needed three. But these are just uh, fabric treat bags. And they're 4 inch by 6 inch. And it has a little draw strings right here where you pull them close and then we have the rose petals 300 count and we have them in red and pink okay and the rest is some makeup this is a new setting spray it sets and helps Extend Makeup Wear, and it's LA Colors. As you can see, it says new right there. And then this is LA Colors Bronzer. LA Colors Setting Powder. Now, this is a slightly darker shade than it shows up on camera. And then these are short length. Uh, the name is Passion. You get 12 of them, and they're L.A. Colors Pink and Glitter Pink. The light ones have glitter on them. These. And then there's one right there. And they're short, I think they said. Yes, the short lengths. I don't know about you, but when I put the longer ones on, I'll be typing, and I'll go to hit, say, like the L, and my nail hits the one right above it, you know. And um, the last thing from Family Dollar, I bought this L.A. Colors Conceal It. And this is what the beige looks like. Alright, the next is from Amazon. Okay, I bought this um, Gnome Valentine Ribbon. It has the wire in it. This one has gnomes and hearts. Going all the way around. This one's just checkered, pink and white. I love the heart ones on this one. And then there's this one with gnomes and hearts. Different gnomes going all the way around. And then... There's two movies, uh, Master Z, IP Man Legacy. It is from the legendary action pack, uh, director, Ying Wo Ping, The Matrix, and Kill Bill. My husband, well, he's got me into the uh, IP Man, but he absolutely loves IP Man. Here's the back. And then here is Justice League Throne of Atlantis. And there's, I normally do my word count, my word puzzles by finding the word and circling it. But uh, I thought I would, you know, extend out a little bit and get the crossword puzzle book. It's volume one. It's only around like four twenty four, four twenty five, and uh, it was free shipping. But you have to get over twenty five dollars worth of stuff for um, that says free shipping in order to get the free shipping. But it's a good deal. And this has two hundred and fifty challenge and puzzles, and that's how thick it is. Let's see. That's the back. I'll show you some. That's some of them. 
See, I'm having a hard time seeing them too because of my eyes. It's hard. I have to hold it like this and bring it up. <laughs> I had to adjust like a lens on a camera. <laughs> okay, and then this is Bower Ultimate Blogger Kit Smartphone Blogging Setup. Um, that's the last thing got from um, Amazon. My mind went blank there. All right, I want to thank you all for stopping by and checking out my channel. If you liked it, uh, hit that big thumbs up bell. It really uh, helped my channel grow. And if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell right next to it. That way you won't miss any of my future uploads. And I'd love to have you as part of my family here on YouTube. All right, have a great day. Until next time.